Wow, he's low. Good morning, everyone. How you doing? Make sure my mic's on. It's Paul here from Unusual Things. Now, this morning, I am back at Mortlake Crematorium. I've been here before. Um, now, before I came here, and I told you about a few people that were cremated here, um, one being Richard Beckinsale. Now, before, I couldn't find his plaque. But as I was passing, I thought we'd have another look for it, okay? So what I'm gonna do very shortly is give you some more information on Richard Beckinsale, and then I'm gonna go and have a look for his plaque because he's a great actor and he got taken way too soon. And he has a beautiful daughter. Everyone loves Kate Beckinsale, don't they? Was it just me? I don't know. No, she's lovely. She's a great actress. Anyway, uh, she's in the films like Underworld and um, what's the other one? Oh, Serendipity. Great Christmas movie if you haven't seen it. It's a good movie. It's a good love film. There you go. If you like that sort of stuff, it's a good love film. Uh, but she's a great actress. She's been in lots of things. But Richard Beckinsale, of course, was a great actor. He was in Porridge. Tell you a little bit more about him real soon. But we're going to go and have a look for his plaque as well. It's going to be Richard Beckinsale. Now, he was born on the 6th of July, 1947, and passed away on the 19th of March, 1979, aged 31 years old. He was born in Nottinghamshire to an, uh, an Anglo-Burmese father, John Beckinsale, and an English mother, Maggie Barlow. In his first school play, he played Dopey in Snow White. His first TV appearance was as a police officer in Coronation Street in 1969. He also starred in The Lovers, Porridge, Rising Damp and Going Straight. He also had a part in Armchair Thriller. Do you remember Armchair Thriller? Such a great show. I used to love that when I was a kid. I used to scare the daylights out of me. And in films, Rent a Dick and Free For All. Now Richard had two children. His first daughter, Samantha, born in 1966 with his first wife, Margaret. And then second daughter, Kate, born with second wife, Judy Lowe. After complaining of feeling unwell to fellow co-star Anna Calder Marshall on the 18th of March, Richard said he was scared of dying and being alone. He got home that night, called his daughter Samantha to arrange to see her. And he also phoned some friends and said that he was unwell, but he was complaining of chest and arm pains, but he was making real light of it and having a bit of a laugh and a bit of a joke. Um, but when he didn't arrive for rehearsals the next day on the set of Bloomers, the producers called and a family friend that was staying with them at the time who was looking after his daughter answered the phone and she thought he must have overslept so she went upstairs and um, tried to wake him but sadly she couldn't. On the 19th of March 1979 Richard had died overnight in his bed asleep of a massive heart attack. Such a shame, such a great actor as well. And to be taken at that young an age and so many people afterwards said you know what a waste they thought he had such a great future and he did if you look at his his acting skills i know he played some comedy parts and whatever but he had such an opportunity to have a great career ahead of him and it's such a shame that he was taken so young but anyway we're going we'll have a look for his plaque shall we so i've come into where all the plaques are and we'll have a little look now to see if we can find richard's I think I found it this time. There we are, Richard Beckinsale, 1947 to 1979, held in a heart, wife Judy, daughter Kate, and all who loved him. Wow. So we have Richard Beckinsale, we finally found his plaque. Great actor, amazing man. Thank you, Richard. Bless you. Um, let's come out of here. So yeah, we finally found Richard Beckinsale's plaque, which is one that I've been wanting to find for a while because he was a great actor and I really liked his stuff. I thought he was funny and he was just taken way too soon. Um, but yeah, we got him. We found him at last. Um, Richard Beckinsale. So there you go. Uh, please leave your comments down below. Thumbs up, all that sort of stuff. 
Um, if you liked Richard Beckham's set, can you say his name? Yeah? Ba, 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 ba. Uh, Richard Beckham's out, then please leave your comments down below. Let me know what sort of things you liked him in. Porridge, I thought, was brilliant, of course. Uh, he was in Rising Damp as well. Um, but yeah, great, great actor. Anyway, that's it for me for Mortlake Crematorium, and I will see you all soon on the next one. Take it easy.